Hello everyone, welcome to Man Manga Boy talks to you about Zatch Bell and spoils Zatch Bell 2 Chapter 1. This is a continuation of Zatch Bell and I'm gonna have spoilers about this chapter and the uh, you know Zatch Bell series prior. Uh, quick non-spoilery thoughts. I'm interested in this series and the direction it's going. It's definitely darker, very much darker than what Zatch Bell was. And it makes me realize that uh, the editor who was following uh, for Zatch Bell really made the series a lot more child friendly. And that Raiko is, is a dark hearted mofo, very dark. Into the spoilers. So we pick off um, following this demon and some baby and this other guy who escaping the Momoto world or demon world. But the um, two giant guys or one giant guy and one kid are stopping them. And apparently they're planning to destroy all the demons for whatever reason. They show a little flashback of Ted, Rain, and Cherise, and they're all dead, as well as this Ziggy guy, apparently. I don't I don't know. I can't believe we see Maiming. <laughs> I can't believe we have these really cool spells and bottles that I thought was very interesting. I also am shocked that we're seeing such an ugly look at the world. It's, it's really blowing my mind that we get to see such an ugly look at the world after having such a positive ending. But, you know, I guess that makes sense. Something I doubt that happened, though, that they say happened, is that Zatch is dead. Really, this is called Zatch Bell 2. You guys think Zatch is dead? Uh, I don't think so. The artwork is definitely better than where Zatch Bell left off. And so I am really enjoying this. I'm looking forward to seeing where this goes. I like the transportation machine. Very reminiscent of Faudo. I do wonder who the heck this guy is that would have this machine. Because they never really say who made Faudo or why he has this device or anything like that. But, you know, it's got to be cool. Got to be cool. So I'm interested to see what happens with this. And Keo looks shredded. The dude looks ripped AF. And he's about to fight a demon, I mean, on his own. This is going to be awesome. So I'm excited to see what keo has been up to. It looks like, to me, that he's in college. But maybe he's out of college, I don't know. But I'm very, very interested in this series and where it's going to. I was uh, surprised to see they use a Sharish spell. Since um, Sharisha spells... We're usually for sniping, and this dude just uses it kind of like a shotgun blast, which was neat, but interesting stuff. And everybody on in Egypt is really mean, I guess. I guess I know I'm not going to Egypt anytime soon. Um, but, I mean, that was pretty much it about this chapter. I don't know how often this is releasing. I don't know if it's weekly or monthly, but I am super excited. I also heard that, uh, you know, he got his own studio, um, Raiko, apparently owns his own publishing studio. I'm not sure if that's true or not. I can't find anything to say that that is true, but I saw a few people on Reddit talking about that, and I thought that was interesting. Um, but that is pretty much it for this quick little talk. Um, you know, I really think the designs of the demons so far are, are interesting, especially the main character ones. The baby is really odd to me, and the, the main villain reminds me kind of of Nomu. Not too much to go off of, though, for now, since we're only at the, the beginning of this story. But I, I totally think Zatch is still alive. What do you guys think down in the comments below? Please let me know if you read it. And if you need to know how to read it, just shoot me a DM. Um, no announcements for this in English quite yet, but, you know, I'm sure we're going to get something. Uh, but, yeah, please let me know what you thought in the comments below. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, and if you like more of these videos, definitely let me know that too down below. Thank you so much for watching this quick little impressions video. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.